Title, The Fluffy Tail Manual, Chapter 1, The Strange Discovery. In the small town of Pinewood, there lived a curious 12-year-old boy named Max. Max had always been fascinated by animals, especially those with fluffy tails. One day, while exploring his grandmother's dusty attic, Max stumbled upon an old, leather-bound book. The title read, The Fluffy Tail Manual, A 14-Step Guide to Growing Your Very Own Tail. Intrigued, Max couldn't resist opening the book. Inside, he found detailed instructions, sketches, and warnings about how to grow a long, fluffy tail. Though the idea seemed absurd, Max's curiosity got the better of him. What if it actually worked? With a determined grin, he decided to give it a try. Chapter 2, Step 1, The Magical Seed The first step instructed Max to find the magical seed hidden deep in the forest. The seed was said to have been left by the ancient tail fox, a mythical creature with the fluffiest tail imaginable. Max ventured into the forest, following the book's directions. After hours of searching, he found a glowing seed nestled under a towering oak tree. He brought the seed home and planted it in a small pot, as the manual instructed. Within minutes, the seed sprouted into a tiny, shimmering plant. Max marveled at its beauty, feeling a strange connection to it. Chapter 3, Step 2 the Tail Whisper The next step required Max to speak the Tail Whisper, an ancient chant that would bind the magic of the seed to him. Max felt a bit silly, but he followed the instructions, whispering the strange words softly. As he finished, a tingling sensation ran down his spine. It was faint, but he swore he felt something shifting at the base of his back. Chapter 4 Step 3 The Fox's Dream That night, Max had a vivid dream. He was in a vast, moonlit field, and in front of him stood the tail fox. The fox had a tail so fluffy and long that it seemed to float in the air. The fox spoke to him, saying, Continue the steps, young one, and you shall inherit the gift of the tail. When Max woke up, he felt more determined than ever. Chapter 5, Step 4, The Fluffy Diet The manual now instructed Max to follow a strict diet of fluffy foods, which included cotton candy, marshmallows, and cloudberries. Though the foods were odd, Max eagerly embraced the diet, believing it would bring him closer to his goal. As the days passed, he noticed his hair becoming softer and fluffier. Chapter 6, Step 5, The Tail Exercises Max began performing a series of strange exercises designed to strengthen the muscles at the base of his spine. These exercises involved lots of stretching and balancing, and although they were exhausting, Max could feel something growing. A small bump had appeared at the base of his spine, and it was slowly getting bigger. Chapter 7, Step 6, The Tail Grooming Kit The next step involved crafting a tail grooming kit. Max gathered the necessary items, a brush made from enchanted feathers, a comb carved from the wood of the oak tree where he found the seed, and a bottle of magical tail oil. He diligently brushed and oiled the bump every day feeling it grow softer and fluffier. Chapter 8, Step 7, The Full Moon Ritual On the night of the full moon, Max performed a ritual in his backyard. As the manual instructed, he danced under the moonlight, chanting the tail whisper while holding his tail grooming kit. The light of the moon seemed to wrap around him, and he felt a sudden, intense growth at his back. When the ritual ended, Max turned to see a small, fluffy tail had sprouted. Chapter 9 Step 8, The Tail Protector The manual warned that newly grown tails were fragile and needed protection. Max crafted a tail protector using soft fabrics and enchanted thread. He wore it every day, ensuring that his tail stayed safe as it continued to grow. Chapter 10, Step 9, The Tail Strengthening Potion Next, Max brewed a tail strengthening potion using ingredients like dragon's breath, a rare flower, and phoenix feathers. He drank the potion, and his tail immediately felt stronger, its fluffiness intensifying. Chapter 11, Step 10, The Tail Bonding Ceremony The tail bonding ceremony required Max to spend an entire day bonding with his tail. He brushed it, talked to it, and even named it Fluffy. By the end of the day, he felt a deep connection with his tail, as if it were an extension of himself. Chapter 12, Step 11, the tail's first adventure. The manual now encouraged Max to take his tail on an adventure. He went on a hike through the forest, 
his tail swishing behind him. Along the way, he noticed that his tail seemed to have a mind of its own, pointing out paths and helping him find hidden treasures like berries and flowers. Chapter 13 Step 12 The Tail's Power As Max continued to follow the manual, he discovered that his tail had powers. It could sense danger, and when Max concentrated, the tail could lift objects or act as a third hand. Max practiced these abilities daily, honoring his control over his tail. Chapter 14 Step 13 The Final Tail Growth The second to last step was the most crucial. It required Max to perform all the previous steps in one day, eating fluffy foods, doing tail exercises, grooming his tail, and more. By the end of the day, his tail had grown long and incredibly fluffy just like the tail foxes in his dream. Chapter 15 Step 14 The Tail Fox's Blessing In the final step, Max had to return to the forest where he found the seed and wait for the tail fox to appear. On a quiet, starry night, Max stood under the oak tree, his fluffy tail swishing behind him. The tail fox emerged from the shadows, its eyes glowing with approval. You have completed the manual, young one. The tail fox said, You are now the guardian of the fluffy tail, and with it, you shall protect the magic of the forest. Max bowed respectfully, feeling the weight of the responsibility. The tail fox placed its paw on Max's head, and a warm light enveloped him. When the light faded, Max's tail was even fluffier, and he felt a surge of magical energy. Epilogue, the fluffy-tailed guardian. Max returned home. Now known as the fluffy-tailed guardian of Pinewood, he used his tail's powers to help others, protect the forest, and bring joy to those around him. The fluffy tail manual had changed his life, and he knew he would carry its lessons with him forever.